When you listen to a song, whether it's on the radio or your phone, you probably don't think about what it takes to get that song to you. But members of the local band Avenue Beat moved to Nashville a couple of years ago to pursue a career in music, and that group recently recorded several new songs for an upcoming EP. KQA's Chad Douglas takes you behind the scenes in this KQA exclusive. Here is a rare look inside a recording studio in Nashville. <laughs> and it's just like an old house, and there's just a studio in it. We recorded vocals like in the same room. Take that show on the road out the door. And those vocals aren't recorded the way you would think. Well, we went one at a time, but like you could you could watch each other when we do it, because there's like a glass door, so they would be like making funny faces at me while we were doing stuff. Sometimes I mess it up. For a group that has incredible harmony, singing tracks one at a time was definitely different. We'll do like a million takes of one song just to make sure you get the right vocal comp. There's also a reason behind all of those takes. We were able to just like experiment with it and perfect things and I sort of equated it to like, you know, doing theater, which we all did. It's like once you've learned your lines, you've learned the blocking, you've learned your songs, you got to mess around with it and just have fun and try things and fail at things and just get to feel the joy of that. But, you know, whatever, whatever. So far, the group has recorded four songs. They are now signed to a publishing deal with Tape Room Music. The people behind this publishing company are no strangers to success, with hit songs by Thomas Rhett, Trace Atkins, and Florida Georgia Line and B.B. Rexa, just to name a few. The dude who's producing our staff just produced Carrie Underwood's record. At this time, there's no word on when an album or EP will be released by Avenue Beat, but you can bet when that happens, we'll be the first to tell you. <laughs> In Nashville, Chad Douglas, KHQA we News. Gotta stick together. Now, the group hasn't been performing much in Nashville because the ladies have been focused on riding, but that could soon change. They tell Chad they miss the stage and hope to be back on the stage very soon.